तो हेलो एवरीवन इस वीडियो में हम डिस्कस करेंगे आईआईटी कानपुर में स्टैटिस्टिक्स डिपार्टमेंट द मैथमेटिक्स एंड स्टैटिस्टिक्स डिपार्टमेंट में पीएचडी इंटरव्यू का एक्सपीरियंस सो जैसे मीटिंग स्टार्ट हुआ द फर्स्ट दे आस्क अस टू इंट्रोड्यूस योरसेल्फ ओके सो फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वाज इंट्रोड्यूस योरसेल्फ ओके एंड देन दे आस्क Uh, like which uh, area you want to be uh, preferred for this interview so like i said probability and statistics so the first question they asked is uh, how many mode of convergence you know mode of convergence in probability you know how many mode of convergence in probability you know so like we have uh, almost sure convergence uh, convergence in probability convergence in distribution or convergence in moments like this so then said which one implies uh, which so like we you know almost sure implies convergence in probability and this implies convergence in distribution so then they asked and uh, what is a distribution what is distribution function so next question they asked what is distribution function distribution function and uh, then they asked distribution function and distribution of random variable are they different or same so distribution function and distribution of random variable are they different or same so next question they asked so difference between distribution function distribution function and distribution of random variable uh, are they different or same okay so the next question was so define what is convergence in distribution define it so it is convergence in distribution and uh, where it is used is there any uh, specific theorem or result where it is used so they ask so the answer is central limit theorem so in the central limit theorem we use convergence in distribution and then uh, they asked uh, what is central limit theorem so so they are what is central limit theorem so then after this uh, they started with linear algebra so they asked the next question so find the maximum value of x x dash ax upon x dash bx so what is the value of this so in that they are uh, they said also you can uh, what if you take b is equal to i or uh, you have given that b is a positive definite matrix b is a positive definite matrix b is positive definite matrix so me why they also ask what is positive definite matrix so what is positive definite what is positive semi definite what is positive semi definite and uh, if a is positive definite so can we write a is equal to Uh, suppose you have given that a is symmetric okay positive definite matrix so can we write it c into c transpose for a matrix c and next they asked uh, ax is equal to b is a system of linear equation so a is m cross n matrix okay b is a column m cross 1 so the question is uh what can you say about the solution of this or uh when can you say that this system equals uh, this system has a solution then the next question they asked what if uh 
ax is equal to zero, then what is the condition under which you can say x will be equal to zero? So under which condition uh, x will be equal to zero? And then next question, they came again in probability. So x given y random variable is independent of is independent of z given y. So can you say? So can you say x is independent of z? X is independent of z. So answer yes or no. So you have given x given y is independent of z given y. So can you say x is independent of z? If yes, then prove. If no, then give the example. And then they started with confidence intervals. So they asked the question like, x1, x2, x100, sorry, xn. These are IID, normal mu1. So what is the confidence interval for mu? So what is confidence interval for mu? And uh, suppose I say, so one, three is 95% confidence interval for mu. Then what is your interpretation? Then what is its interpretation? What is the interpretation? So how will you interpret this statement that one three is a 95% constant interval for mu? And then they, so this was the, uh, mainly this was the question, okay? So they were, uh, they asked this question. So interview was almost 30 to 40 minutes. Okay. Uh, sorry, so 47 minutes, yeah. So that's all and thank you.